Hi there, and welcome to the Proxy Sale channel. My name is Andrew. In today's tutorial, I'll show you how to configure a proxy within the BlueStacks emulator on your PC. This process ensures anonymous and secured interactions with apps on BlueStacks. Given that the emulator lacks built in proxy settings, we'll use Proxifier to target only BlueStacks without affecting the entire operating system. Let's get started. Open Proxifier and navigate to the Profiles tab. Next, choose Proxy Servers. In the open window, click Add and fill in your proxy information. Provide the IP and port data in the address and port fields, respectively. In the Protocol drop-down, select the appropriate protocol. If you are using a private proxy, enable authorization and input your credentials in the subsequent username and password fields. For free proxy, this step is unnecessary. After entering the details, verify the proxy's connectivity by selecting Test. A green message indicates a successful connection, while red suggests the need for a new proxy. Confirm your settings by clicking OK, followed by Yes in the confirmation prompt. Navigate to the Profiles tab, this time selecting Proxy Rules. Click Add to set a new rule. Name your rule accordingly and under the Applications section browse and select the BlueStacks executable file located on your drive. For the action parameter, assign the proxy you configured earlier for use with BlueStacks. Finalize by clicking OK. And just like that, you've successfully set up a proxy for BlueStacks. Your emulator interactions are now both secure and anonymous. Let me remind you that your work as well as your accounts may be at risk if you operate with free proxies that can be found on a network. Such proxies do not have guarantees of anonymity and security. We recommend a reliable and trusted provider ProxySale.com, which will allow you to get proxies of any location with guaranteed anonymity and security for working on a network. The link will be in the description. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe buttons. See you in the next video.